Previously on Welcome to the Family. All their sponsors from all over the country come to one location and they get really emotional. A new friend that I've made, but then he soon realized we don't work with time. <laughs> Thank you from the bottom of my heart. My team is going to continue working even after the tour. Anyone can entertain you, but only we entertain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Are you ready? Welcome to the family. Good morning, guys. So today is um, probably one of the last um, episodes that you'll see the team um, super exhausted because by the end of today, we'll all be hibernating in Miami for at least 12 hours a piece. We had fun. It was awesome. It was a great experience. It was actually better than last year. Every year it gets better. We went all the way from the east side, the west side. We ended up all the way down south to Punta Gorda. A lot of the villages got together and brought the children to some of the main parts. So we were able to touch people in smaller villages too this time. In such a welcoming country that every time we come here, our team kind of cries to leave because our hearts really stay here with the people and, and with this entire country. The reception here is just phenomenal and I can recommend to anybody anywhere around the world for them to come here and experience some of this here. You're making it happen. Next time when you come, I'll definitely have some better news. Yes, talk to you soon. Thanks stay in touch with us. Home. We're heading home, we're going back to the States. We're done with our tour. Today is our departure day. A little tired, a little bit, a little bit more than tired. Bittersweet feeling. Like you don't want to leave. You want to stick around a little longer because you know you can do so much more. But yet, you know, you miss home. You you have your children. You have your home. So we need to go back home, recharge ourselves. Every year we get stronger, bigger, and better. Alrighty. So it is the final day of hanging out with Gizmo. <laughs> His owner is coming back today and I bet he's really happy. Are you happy? Your person's coming back today. Yes, she is. Uh, Riverside Tavern. Same by the Dusty. Yeah, I know man, I was out. Good job. Good job. And before the team jumped back on the plane from Miami, we decided to stop at one of our sponsors, Dustin's Riverside Tavern, for one last Belizean meal. Alright, Heavenly Father, bless the food that we're about to eat, bless the friends that we are with. I think I'm good. That plane's gonna be hard to take off. Bye! Good night to see you guys. So much. We love and everything. It's our final interview before we go back on stage. I'm having the team do it. I was working together as a team, not just working one on one. And you know, as a group, we've been able to actually make this happen. Like right now, um, our one of our sponsors, the Riverside Tavern. I mean, before we left, they said, "Why don't you come over and have lunch?" And that's what it's all about. So, what's it like working in the studio? The studio alone? It's been very, 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 very quiet. No one there. No one there. No one there. No one there. But someone there. I missed him, but he's on that plane. And there's mine. Hopefully they'll call me soon. I can't believe this war is over. It's crazy. It went so fast, it was so hard, and now it's back to reality. It's flight 1419 to Miami. We're not going to Belize, we're in Belize. Our flying time today is one hour, 40 minutes at 35,000 feet. So I made it to the Atlanta airport. I've been hanging out for a while, forgot. Um, but oh, I got sick. I guess my body has just decided to finally let it all hit me, so. Anyway, just a little bit longer and then I'll be on my way. So Gizmo is out walking me again and false alarm little buddy. Your little mom's not coming back until, well she's coming back tonight, but she's not going to pick you up until tomorrow morning. How do you feel about that? So tomorrow morning, you will be picked up. He's much more concerned about peeing. 
all over everything, 4,000 times. I'm falling nuts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I turned it on. <laughs> Oh my god. Bro's freaking out. <laughs> Bro's freaking out about the internet speed. <laughs> <laughs> so, we made it to Miami. We're at baggage claim waiting for bags right now. There's one thing that I don't like about airports. It's this little cart thing that they don't even give you. You have to buy like five bucks for this little cart that's half a piece of luggage and then you have to Tetris your luggage on top of it and it's very annoying. So, I actually stumbled across this uh, flatbed. Wasn't really looking for it, found it, and I was like, well, this is awesome, you know? Like, like, just, this is great. And it wasn't locked up or anything. There wasn't anybody next to it, so I'm like, this is good. I've never seen this flatbed before, but this is perfect for all of the stuff that we have. Yeah. It was just lying on the side, and you know, it didn't have a lock on it, so I was like, sure, why not? I thought I was the luckiest one in the airport. So I'm sitting there, waiting for the rest of my luggage to get here, and I get a tap on my shoulder, and it's a gentleman in a uniform, and he says, um, can I help you, sir? And I'm like, no, no, I'm good, thank you. And I knew there was something up when he asked me twice. He was like, are you sure? Can I, can I help you with anything? I was like, no, no, thank you. And he's like, okay, well, give me my cart back. That was horrible. At that moment, I was like, damn. I knew it was too good to be true. This sucks. It was cool for that like five minute window. I thought it was awesome. So just landed in Fort Lauderdale and it's like midnight. Oh, I'm tired. But now I'm gonna go get picked up by my brother-in-law and decide whether I'm staying up here or going home. I'm very tempted to go home and pick up a little gizmo. Hey guys, my name's LJ with Bowl Worlds. Welcome to the family. And I'm here just to let you guys know that you should like, Comment and subscribe. Hey. Oh, of course, of course. Share it too. Alright, guys, see you in the next video.